Good morning, it is Sunday, July 21st. We're taking another look at guncalendars.com where we try to archive as much interesting two-way history, firearms related events as possible. And today we have, a, I think, an interesting, it's not really gun related, I guess, but an interesting uh, anniversary. Uh, this one is, uh, it's kind of multi-folded. So uh, the, there were war dogs in World War II. Many dogs were donated by families uh, to the Marines and to the other branches. And as a memorial to the war dogs for the Marines on uh, Iwo Jima, there's a, a memorial. And that memorial has a duplicate or a, a sister memorial uh, here in Tennessee. And that was dedicated on the 21st of July, 1994. And that's a, a war dog memorial. And uh, just always been a fan of the war dogs being a Doberman owner. Uh, the Dobermans were a big part, especially for the Marines on Iwo Jima, uh, of their success. And uh, the story that families donated their dogs knowing they weren't going to see them again, that those dogs wouldn't probably return, uh, is, a, is a very interesting um, facet and something if you haven't researched it or if you haven't dug into it, uh, we encourage you to do so, especially today the day that the uh, War Dog Memorial was dedicated in 1994. A little extra history. Today uh, in 1873, Jesse James and his gang robbed their first train. Notice they had to do that in 1873 because they weren't going to be able to do that when there was Dobermans around. This is the kind of stuff we do on guncalendars.com to try to keep people aware of our history, where we come from, so that we don't repeat it, so that we don't forget the good stuff that came, so that we can look forward to more good stuff in the future. Thanks to our Patreons that make it possible. Let us know in the comments what you think. As always, thanks for watching.